Hey guys, how's it going? This is Luchi from Next Level Gaming Guides, and in this video, we have moved on to the next area, the next area of leveling. I'm not quite sure if you can get any quests around here quite yet, but I am going to venture around, see what I can find, see if I can find anything interesting. It looks kind of cool. Um, when you look on the map here, it's called Valley of the Four Winds. And no, I don't want to join your guild, buddy. And then it looks kind of, one of my first impressions is it looks kind of like a wrathy basin when you look at it it's kind of got like the you know the shape of a wrathy basin it's got the wall over here that you could go through like in a wrathy basin in an alteric mountains area um so that's my first overall look of it maybe they took like the actual arathi basin and then just scaled over it because like there's a lot of little hills and stuff around here like arathi basin so i'm gonna go ahead and go through and take a look at some stuff and see if I can find some cool stuff for you. One thing I want to notice here that I want to show you guys is if you look at this wolf right here, it's like a white wolf. It's got the other thing that was uh, implemented in the Cataclysm, that other wolf look. And it looks pretty cool, so hunters out there, if you like the, like the wolf. I know wolves are decent for, um, for hunters as far as what the hell is that over there. Holy 261 million health. Looks like, guys, we found our first raid boss. Wow. Let's go take a look at it. Our out, outdoor raid boss, they said they're going to be implementing that. Um, it looks pretty crazy. It's big. Yeah, I just came, came out of nowhere. I was looking at that wolf, and it just popped out of nowhere. So I'm going to go take a look at it. And... Uh, Maybe I'll even die for you guys and see what kind of ability it casts on me or something, just to kind of give you a little bit of insight there. Alright. It looks like he has, like, a pet friend or something, Chief Stallius. And he, like, helps... He has a lot of health, too. This is a crazy... And he's got, like, guys on top of him, like, little guys on top of him that you need to kill. This guy's big and crazy. Now, the where you would find this is it looks like he's on the outskirts here in between uh, this area down here and the Valley of the Four Winds. So, yep, that's him. So, uh, doing this for you guys. Oh, God. Oh, bubble. <laughs> he hit me once and almost killed me. What do you he got? Uh, physical... Oh, 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 look at me tanking him and ret, ret stand. Oh. Then all the guys fall off of him. <laughs> Someone was like watching me back there, like, what are you doing? Unless there's like a bunch of people watching me. That's funny. Alright, I'm gonna res up and see what else I can find around here. Alright, and now we are out front of the brewery instance. And you can see on the map here where it's located. And yeah, I could tell this was uh, one of the new instances because I had the stone right out front, which was great. Um, you can tell this place is huge, you know, it's a big, big building. And then when I tried to uh, go into what it looks like is going to be the instance portal thingy, um, it denied me and said I had to be a, I had to be level 82 or have Missa Pandaria expansion installed to enter. Um, kind of do. I'm in the beta, so maybe. That's just something that's just not released, and that's what's happening right now. But yep, this, uh, the, I'll sh back up a little bit so you can kind of see the building here. I mean, it's this huge building. It's crazy. It seemed, it seemed pretty weird to have such a, a building so big uh, on the outside, and it really means nothing because you portal into an instance, which is like a little portal thingy, so... I'm gonna keep running around and... See if I can find anything else. I'm getting a bunch of XP from just running around. Every time I ex like move 20 feet, I get like 11,000 XP from exploring something. So, see what else I can find for you guys. All right, and something else that I found here is this on your map here. You can see this incredibly large wall, and it's it's a really big wall, and it has a little break in the middle there, and it makes me think, you know. I know you're going with the Asia theme, but did you really have to put the Wall of China in here? I mean, come on. Be a little more uh, original than that. I am going to try and venture through this stuff. See if I don't get ported back to <laughs> Jade Forest by Blizzard. See if I can discover some more stuff for you. 
Alright, and for the last area that I have reached, I found this, like, farm area. Now, there's no NPCs here. I mean, there's this guy, but... I mean, there's just, like, nothing going on here. And it's just this huge area full of, you know, little farm places and stuff like that. And I actually heard some, uh, information, um, cons about the game coming up. Is that you're gonna be able to own your own little farmland patch. And you can actually make money off of it with, like, cooking. And you can, like, make your own, you know, stuff. You can grow plants and stuff like that. So, I just got my instance to pop in. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And I hope you found this video informative and exploring the new area here. And it seems pretty cool. And, you know, I look forward to bringing you guys some more stuff. Just gonna go ahead and level up. Alright, see you guys.